Okay, so now uh, we've gone over the L shape or the box. Try to remember chords and shapes. Okay, for me, I look at a major chord as uh, a some steps. If you look at this, it looks like steps going down from knuckle to, you know, and you know you can go up and down steps. That's what that's what a major chord looks like to me. Okay. Um, what we're doing is a minor, so that's going to be a G minor. All right, right there. That's your G. So, but we're not going to play the bass notes. We're going to leave. We're going to leave those notes out. We're just going to play the top notes. Remember, just take that finger, put it on those first three strings. One, two, three, and then. Take this finger, put it on the fifth fret of the fourth string. All right, that's going to complete your L shape. You can see the L right here. That's your L or your box. If you look at it from that perspective, that's a box. So remember shapes. Try to remember shapes in the beginning. Uh, Later on, when you get into uh, theory, you can get into, uh, you know, all of the diminished uh, chords and all of that. Uh, right now, we're just, we're just taking it really simple, really simple, basic. All right, so uh, we've done the box. Now, what I'd like you to do is take that minor or take that major on that third, remember on the third fret, that's going to that's gonna start your, your major. And minor, all right. You put that one here. That's major. That's minor, all right. What I want you to do is take these two fingers. See these two fingers? These two fingers right here. Put this one on the fifth fret of the fourth string. Take this one. Put it on the fourth fret of the third string. What you're going to get is something that sounds like this. Get it? Okay. Now, I want you to move that whole shape up one, but remove the sec your second finger and replace that with your your third finger okay so you what, it, what it's going to look like is this that's going to go this one is going to go on your seventh fret fourth string this one will go on your fifth fret third string all right that's going to sound something like this notice how that's got kind of a dreamy sound
go something like that. So that's part two, just getting used to the... Always gonna go like that. Major, major, minor, minor, major. Minor. Minor. Major. Okay. So that's something you can roll with. Um, we can go off into. Uh, we go off into that later um we'll cover the finger styles in a moment um but take that and work with it <laughs> 